Welcome back to Bargain Bin Lounge. <laughs> now, of course, we're all about getting bargains here at Bargain Bin Lounge, but sometimes you want something a little extra, maybe a little something a bit more premium. I mean, you get yourself a nice double cheeseburger with the uh, prime grade br prime grade beef, I suppose. You get the good stuff. Good and uh, fresh lettuce, nice sliced tomato, and a uh, nice layer of American cheese. That's five dollars, but what if, say, you wanted onions, or maybe even extra tomato, or even perhaps two different kinds of cheese, maybe even bacon, or even a second or a third patty? Well, that's going to cost extra, of course. So here, while Vampire Survivors is, of course, five dollars, the DLC on top is, of course, added bonuses. And only, like, two dollars a piece. <laughs> so here we have a premium bargain for you this week. And also because we wanted to talk about Vampire Survivors and didn't want to have to, you know, just like, well, because the DLC is... Yes. Just like, so, so, whatever, let's do some co-op Vampire Survivors. Gonna want to go to enter co-op up there, mate. Absolutely. There go and go. Come on in. So, uh, Vampire Survivors has been getting updates since it has come out. And uh, recently it had a crossover with Among Us. And uh, I kind of wanted to show that off, mainly because I feel bad for all the Switch players who don't have it yet. I don't have all of the characters yet, but we will show off the stage. It is a usual 30-minute stage, so we'll go ahead and try that out. Do you have any character preference? I will counterpick if you... I have one. I guarantee you won't get them, though. I won't... You won't... Okay. Uh, I am going to be... Ooh, I want... Uh... You know what? Z. Z Asunta? I'll take Z. Uh, start. Oh, yeah, there we All right. go. All right. All right. Choose your character. There's a nice rumble. Uh, I am going to go, seeing as how you have uh, most of the main characters. I could go for the invincible character. I was just thinking, yeah, go for the invincible <laughs> I mean, one. I mean, we could do that. <laughs> you could do that, but... Yeah, if you Why the go, fuck yeah, not? Why the why fuck the not? Fuck yeah, not? go for it. All right, so uh, the <laughs> the new stage. I mean, it's it's bargain bin lounge. We could we could of course be cheap. We could do whatever we want. <laughs> yeah, exactly, be cheap. So the Polis replica, one of the stages in Among Us, and uh, this one's actually pretty cool. Do you want to go hurry mode, or do you want to just keep it on a normal? No hurry playthrough? mode, but do put it on hyper mode. Do on hyper. Okay. Hyper Arcanus limit break. That's what ah, I find. That's, more uh, gold, more luck. That's what I find for showing things off and showing power. And uh, this is it's a good catharsis, I'd say. Yeah, yeah, good, I'll go with that. Good balance. In first just makes it harder, and endless just makes it well, never ending. Among us. All right. So start with uh, the. Uh, do you want to do the normal one? What's the normal one? The normal one I go for is the one that brings everything to us. Go two over. Two over. That one. That's the one I was oh, going for. Okay, okay. Whatever weapon you get, there's three more. So that'll power me up, and it'll also... What, whatever weapon I get, I don't think I have anything yet. No, you don't have anything yet, but we'll get you. I, we'll I, get you, I, no I, I will get something, oh but my I, can God. Just, I can just run into shit. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> so the way co-op works in uh, Vampire Survivors is it swaps between the two characters when you level up. So next time, uh, UDJ is going to be getting the experience, he'll have an option to choose a weapon, and then it'll jump back to me. And if you don't know how Vampire Survivors works, well, let me, well, let me tell you about it. Vampire Survivors is a game where you uh, just go around and try and survive and uh, just, just kill, a whole, everything up. kill a whole bunch of people. Exactly. Things are going to be coming at you endlessly, and you get experience for every enemy you kill, and you level up and, of course, can upgrade whatever you end up getting. Oh, I see what you're doing. Each of uh, the... So there are weapons, which is, of course, damaging. Uh, you can pass that to me. Oh, I didn't know what that you, meant. You can pass that to me, which means I can oh! take that. Oh, that's awesome. Uh -huh. I, I didn't know about the pass. I, I honestly yeah. thought that meant pass by your turn. Oh, I, I, I play uh, with I, I play co-op with Vile Ooh. all the time. It's, it's, this, this game is great. This right here is one of the new items that you get from one of the crewmates. There's so much to talk about. I don't know where to start. I know. This is why <laughs> I wanted to do at least one video on it. Right. Also... <laughs> I turned off all the flashes and all the photosensitivity stuff, so we should have just a normal, normal time here in Vampire Survivors. I need to turn off the uh, streamer-friendly music, because I really hate it when they play Counting Crows every time I get the results <laughs> screen. <laughs> Holy shit, we are getting, uh, we are getting a lot. I'm gonna go for... oh, what goes with Flames of Misspell? Is that the, uh, is that the, uh, gold? The gold bar? I don't know. Okay, duplicator I then. <laughs> I haven't worked it with too much. I haven't worked with the, the secret items too much. See, I have specific loadouts that I love going for, and it's mainly just make everything evolve. The way I see it, if you're doing either red or yellow numbers, you're in good shape. 
Uh, how about... We'll, we'll, show, we'll show this off. Everybody gets a level up here. Everybody gets a random level up for something. So you, ha you have weapons in this game, which of course do damage, and then oh, these oh, secondary oh, items wait, wait, are boons. Oh, it's fake. Which basically all they do is they upgrade your something or other. They make you hit harder, they make you go faster. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They make more enemies appear on screen, they give you more coins, they give you more experience. I am dying. I, we need to find some help if uh, we could please. Well, don't worry, you'll live. That's true, it's true. Over here. So, uh, that's fake. That's fake? Yeah, so that's what was added in this stage, is there are, uh, fake healing items that actually turn into monsters when you get too close. They are imposters! So they added mimics. Yup. How about that? Uh, I'm going guns. You're going guns? Well, you, guns well, you already funny. fucked it up, because you can't even get the other one now. What do you mean? Because... Oh, right! So, uh... Your only hope is it, to... It, yeah, your, your only I, I hope need is to... Evolve, I yeah. need to evolve the, the whip. Yeah, thank you. Uh, so if I evolve my whips, then I can get rid of a spell space. Uh, co-op takes... If you evolve your whips, then you can level up the natives. <laughs> Sorry. Uh, co-op, uh, takes away yeah. item slots, depending on how many people you have. You re-roll, and you say you don't like any of those. This is the worst weapon in the game. What? Prisma- oh, uh, the, the got, fucking got cat. Amari. The fucking yeah, cat. The cats. Like, even fully upgraded is not even that good. Even uh, even evolved, it's okay, but yeah, it's, not, it's, it's only okay. It's not worth getting hit by your own projectiles! I think they only take, like, one health point, but it still sucks. It, I, I've died that to a adds cat. up, man! I've died to a cat before, That yes. adds up! Alright, uh, let's start going towards uh, all the different items we have around here. Uh, I've got to take that, I'm sorry. Yes. No, that's absolutely fine. No, I want to see the fully upgraded uh, spell storm here. Taking this for later. Yeah, I, I take that. Your only hope is to upgrade the whips and then yep. get the second gun when you clear up that space. Like that's, why, that's why I'm going for the spell stream. There's one more S, then all three of them combine into one S. So and I then you got more, open space. I can get more weapons. Absolutely. Now, I've, I've already got what I need to evolve the first whip, and then those two combine into one, and the we'll, blue, we'll be fine. The blue whip is already evolved. It's, well, it's an unevolvable weapon, I'd say. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, that... Uh, Flash Arrow needs another item as well, so if you want to just hold on that. Yay! Also, if you forget what you need, you can check this grimoire, which tells you everything It you has need. been so helpful. It certainly has. <laughs> Holy crap, that's so helpful. I needed Clover. So right there, there's an example of some of the new Among Us weapons. The one I'm trying to get is the the healing plus the, the yellow bean there. Uh, it's extremely powerful. <laughs> All right. Almost fully if, uh, fully upgraded Venta Sacro. I think uh, we'll just kind of chill in different areas, and then once we get another uh, card, we'll go ahead and bring everything to us just so we can uh, show everything off. I think that'll go a lot better. Mm -hmm. Even in, uh, this, this is a question for you, uh, Mr. Co-op Man. Yes. Uh, even after you have fully upgraded all your... Uh, weapon slots and everything in co-op. Yes. Can you still do what you do in the normal game and just keep building on that? Like, if I were to get another weapon, would I automatically have five? Yeah. Like, what... What do you mean? Like, I've got my four slots filled in right now. Yes. If I were to pick up another weapon, would it become five or six? If like, you, would if it create were, another row? If you were to pick up another weapon, it would create another... It would, uh, create another row. Yes. Okay, okay. Like, like, one on the field or whatever. Or that works. From a... Special gift box or something. You do not have a lot of good options. Feel free to, yeah, re-roll. Yeah, yeah. re-roll that shit. I always go for spin. Yes. Yes. It's like, hit harder? Uh, yes. Yes, please. You know, that's my that's my tactic. That's my go-to choice. Every single time I pick it up, I accidentally read it as spinch. <laughs> Which I think is an item in another Castlevania game. Yeah, I, I, I think that's a meme, and I think your brain has rotted. Spinch. <laughs> Pick up spinch. Spinch, spinch but nor nor, whatever. <laughs> Oh, there we go. Tor uh, Torna's box is what goes with the, uh... That actually goes with quite a few legendary weapons. It's pretty awesome. So a skull matic which perks me. I I don't like the fact that that's a thing. <laughs> it hurts so bad. It's like a, a make-the-game harder item. Oh, Lovely. great! Well, what, what is it upgrade? Yeah, okay, it upgrades, it upgrades a few it, things. It upgrades their health, number of enemies, and also damage that they do or something. It hurts! Hey! hey there you go. So now that he has all three spells, once he fully upgrades all three of them, uh, and we manage to get a chest... So chests pop up by these uh, stronger enemies. <gasps> uh, yeah, whichever one. <laughs> stronger enemies drop chests, which uh, are the serotonin type thing. Yeah, right here, right here. here. Here's some pure serotonin. Go. 
And who it goes to is random in co-op. You. I always skip these, so we're going to skip them more going forward. No, that's fine, that's fine. I mean, you've seen it. Matter of fact, let's keep it going, come yeah! on! It's three minutes, and we've already spent the first five minutes just justifying this existence. Justifying? <laughs> that it's, was it's, all it's, you! It's, it's like, all right, I mean, even though it's like, you know, five, it's like five dollars, but even though what we're doing here is a little bit more than that, uh, you know, $5, it's like, two dollars, okay, all the dollars. Like, it's like, technically, like, you know, ten, dollars. It's like ten dollars right now, but it's five dollars to come in, it's like, you get the burger. Oh, it's, it's fine, it's, it's fine. fine. See, when you want an extra, you see, it's it's just a Jaeger shot, that's five dollars, but if you want the Red Bull shot on top of that to make it into a Jaeger, a Jaeger yeah. bomb, well, I mean, hey. Jaeger more like Jaeger. <laughs> I need something negative. I need blue girl. <laughs> Ooh, that sword is actually a fun item. You can do some uh, skips with that. Uh, yeah. I'm gonna upgrade that. Uh, still not doing the best on health, but you will survive, so that's fine. You might have some built-in uh, revives as well, so you'll be alright. I, I, I'm gonna try not to waste the Tiragasu if I can. Even if you did, it wouldn't yeah, matter. I know. I'm not going to die until know, 30 minutes anyway. I know. Still. That's, that's the thing about this invincible character. Uh, at the 30 minute mark, or whenever the time limit is up, they'll just die. There is no going any further. Yeah, that's... Believe it or not, that's the goal of Vampire Survivor, is to survive 30 minutes so the death can kill you afterwards. It's like the, the title, Naked Lunch. Oh, that's me. Uh, there, there is really no vampire, and you can't survive. <laughs> oh, shit. I'm about to get hurt. Uh, this. I'm almost there. Oh, oh, gimme, gimme! Yeah! You about to, you, you said gimme, gimme, and I about stole that from you. Don't do it! Like, why do I? Don't do, I do it! Before. It'd be really mean if you did it. <laughs> oh, by the way, the music rocks in this game. Just... Every stage Always. has nothing but bangers. <laughs> and I, I still can't believe that we get a game like this, which I lost a couple months to when it came to Xbox, finally. Uh, I, uh, yeah, I lost about two months because I was constantly playing it, trying to unlock everything, get all oh. the achievements and everything. Oh, no. What? We, we gotta go do something. Yep. Seismic activity detected. Press the button. All right, so, uh... We gotta go... Do north. Up there. This yeah, do north. This one's easy. Oh, have you... Come on, come on, come on, oh, come, yeah. on come on! You have the steam Let's version, go. right? Let's go! Yes. Okay. Well, here. I was trying not to die. <gasps> oh, here's got, a fiver! Got, gotta let this play. This is like the ultimate one. There's an evolution in there. I think that's for me. Could be for me. Well, I don't think I've upgraded. Do you have a fully upgraded spell stream? I don't think I've upgraded everything yet. So. Oh, wait. It might actually do it for you. Well... Uh, uh, oh, it's no, me! it's you! But you got, you got an upgraded weep! I am okay with that, because now I can get health back. Yay! Yay! So after you get max level with an item and you have its partner item, I guess, then you can have the option for an evolution. Oh my god, there that's me go. again. I will take it. So now I have an upgraded bloody tier that uh, has whip damage and also gives me health back. It saps the life out of these munchsters. So how long has it been since you last played Among Us? Among Us? Uh, two years ago, I got a bunch of... Uh, Discord friends together, and we played a couple rounds. I play with mostly randos. It, uh, I stopped playing with randos when I uh, played on my phone and uh, went into a game. The first meeting came up as I was with other people, and uh, the people said, "Oh yeah, uh, Niskel sus." And I was like, "What the fuck are you talking about? You were with me." <laughs> yeah, he's an anime reviewer. He's sus. He's sus. Uh, <laughs> you gotta watch out for those anime reviewers. Some crazy people. Yeah, they get mad at localization changes. Yeah, I'm glad I'm not there. <laughs> I'm glad I'm one of the good ones. Oh, Niskel. <laughs> there are no good ones. Yeah, because I died. <laughs> there are no good ones. Boo! Boo this man! Boo this man! This must be an imposter I'm talking with. <laughs> Who's supposed to be? Nice. Well, and... You know, Among Us has become uh, Inner Sloth's biggest project now. They kind of canceled all the other projects because Among Us took off. It, it really did. I mean. and, and probably one of the <laughs> one of the funniest things about it is uh, they have become like such a meme and so big in the in the gaming sphere that they can announce a, a new stage 
during E3, or not E3, they can announce it during a Nintendo Direct. Wasn't that when, uh, Welcome to the Fungal? Wasn't that when it was announced? It was during a Nintendo Direct? M maybe? I haven't really kept up with it. Like, I've, I've only ever played the one stage. I never really did the imposter mode where you're playing as, like, an actual out in, you know, out in the open imposter. I mean, it looks fun. I mean, I, I bet I could sink a couple of hours into it if I jump back in, but it's just... Hide and Seek was an interesting update. That was really cool. One player plays as a, a maniac imposter and everybody has to try and hide. And uh, you can speed up the clock by doing tasks, but you need to be careful because it's coming for you. It's it, it's it's just simple fun, and I think that's the best kind of game. Yeah. yeah, yeah. So AAA, uh, the, that's what AAA does, and indeed the ones that ask for seventy dollars per game don't understand. Yeah, Nintendo, get fucked. What? Did you get it? I got. It. Okay, okay. I just got the speech. Speech. Sponge. Spinch. Sponge. I want the mini ghost, but I shouldn't take it. Why not? Uh, it's a boon. You're right, it is. I forgot about that. I could have sworn it was a weapon. Uh, okay. Yay! Yeah, we're all full strength now. At least until one of us upgrades, which will be Get, hopefully here soon. Yeah, give me a chest. Give me a chest. I would like a chest. I want evolution. I desire power. Yeah, I would like some power. Can I have some power? I would like power. With the side of domination! <laughs> you Topped know, with fear! And... I, I gotta say, like, probably one of my favorite memories of Vampire Survivor is being like, Yeah, I'm hot shit! And then dying at 29 minutes, 45 seconds. <laughs> it's... it's heartbreaking, man. It heights. It heights so much. In my favorite moment. There's a secret. You basically have to defeat a non-red reaper, and then you have to like mash down, right, and A. Do like an uppercut, and then like the little toasty guy comes out, and that's how you unlock a secret character. What? And I spent about like 30 minutes. And it didn't work, so I said fuck it and put in the password and. Made it okay, it I was way. about to say. <laughs> I, I was just thinking. Oh my god, that worked for you? No, you just did what I did. It was, <laughs> got the password. It was uh, X death or something. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's like, I, I, I mean, I, I did everything right. I tried a couple times. It's like, well, it's not working, so fuck it. See, I was I was kind of freaking out because I thought there wasn't a way to unlock one of the secret characters. And when I looked online, they said, oh, yeah, you need to do a keyboard combination. And uh, that's how you get it on, on all versions. I was like, well, what do you mean, all versions? No, it isn't. And then uh, they just said, oh, yeah, if you're playing on console, just just use the code. <laughs> okay, okay, okay cool. I added that. I got a knife! <laughs> what do you got there? A knife! No! Have you seen that meme? The old lady's got there a knife! Go. Oh, maybe you haven't seen that meme. Little kid with a knife? That's not a meme, that's daily life, man. <laughs> Concerned mother yells for kid who has knife running around pool. Hilarious. Is that what the meme is? Uh, yeah, it's basically, uh... A mom seeing that her kid has something is oh what you got there and he goes a knife and then runs away <laughs> and she goes no and then the video just ends immediately. Kids don't play with too many knives. Don't play too much Among Us, otherwise you might become sus. <laughs> I sus. I dislike the fact that this game has kind of affected a lot of people's lexicon. Uh, dude, that's sus. Like, I mean, suspicious oh. was a perfectly good, uh, it, it was a perfectly good word, suspicious was. You know, I, I have never seen fucking. so many people use the word sus <laughs> until Among Us got huge. That was, be that became everybody's lexicon by that point. Alright, where is this? Oh, wait, uh, I want that. Uh, random all with. Gimme. Yes! Oh, it could be me. That's it. It could be. It oh could, wait, it might be, actually be I you. Mean, huh? I mean, hey. Upgrade uh, well, that spell see. storm. Oh, uh, oh my God, is it you? Holy shit, it's you! Ha ha ha! I got the super S. I can get two more weapons now. Awesome. What are you gonna get? I don't know, but it's gonna be great. 
So uh, this spell storm rules. Basically, it just creates a big old wave. You see all those sparkles? That's all UDJ power right there. It's just like, you, you like how everything's alive on screen? Me neither. Let's fix yeah, that. Let's fi <laughs> well, it's a good thing you got that now because we're about to get uh, get some stronger enemies. Oh, oh. Uh, if you don't know how uh, the game decides where or Jesus. what enemies to bring in, you skip this one. it's every one to two minutes, I think, where uh, new enemies come in. Oh, a present! Yeah. She's a weepin'. Oh, I will. Uh, just so I don't have to wait for it. There we go. Oh, oh per perfect. Yeah. yeah you I'll, can get I'll another one. Yes, after exactly. That. Yes. That's what I want. Power. 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 Now, uh, UDJ and I share clips every now and again of Vampire Survivors, <laughs> and uh, it's funny playing on the Switch version and just seeing how slow can I actually make it. I, I mean, I, it, it runs to... fine. Oh, jeez, oh, it, it can't even. <laughs> It, it, it can't even render on screen. It's it's popping in and out of existence. Yes. The spell stream is so powerful. Fantastic. Wear a clock. Oh, you just uh, did I get that or did you get that? I think I got that. You got that. All right, I wear the clock. All right, here we go. All right, uh, let's go ahead and take out the Atlantean. Oh, is that what they're called? All right, I'll, I'll just stay here then. All right, he's got dead. Him. Awesome. <laughs> All right. Uh, let's it's never been it. that fast. Let's see. Projectile <laughs> explosions. Healing is double. We don't need healing anymore. Uh. Da -da 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 -da. I, I didn't even... Come here! I collected the wrong thing. Come Damn here. it. All right, well, do you want to start heading towards those arrows? Just so we can uh, get some of those fun little things? Oh, I suppose we could try. Okay. Let's go. I mean, we can just basically go anywhere. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I just need to make sure I don't collect another weapon until the guns are fully upgraded. Ooh, I love Glass Fandango. It's such a, such a funny weapon. I do, too. It's, it's great. It's so funny. It's just like, oh, hey, I picked up a clock. I stole Oh, jeez! Oh, my God! Boy, it, it's having a real hard time rendering this. This is the first time, uh, sorry. It's like the third time I've ever done co-op on this version of Vampire Survivors, and it Whoa! it should be able to handle it. We're on, we're on Xbox, it should be able to handle anything. Ahem. Anyway, uh, fever time. Did you know what a thing Xbox can't handle? What criticism! I, <laughs> I thought you were about to say D's nuts for some reason. <laughs> I'm smarter than that. <laughs> You'd think. <laughs> oh my god, we're getting so much. Alright, that's fully upgraded guns. Now I just need to criticize these nuts. These <laughs> 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 nuts is not a that is not a sensible chuckle joke. That's sus, bro. Oh wait, hang on. Here. Uh yes, I I need to take a drink for a sec. Oh jeez. Oh, wow, you just got everything, didn't you? Yeah, so this is what vampire survivors can eventually become, is just sitting there and enjoying the carnage. Just, you know, take a sip here. Take a sip here. Let's check my email real quick. Exactly. Oh, wait. Hey, this is me. So it's me. Oh, wait, that's I you. Get the knives! Okay. More knives! Infinite knives. What's better than knives? More knives! <laughs> <laughs> I want to go get items. Can we go get items? But knives! But knives! But knives! Knives and uh, sprite limitation sparkles! <laughs> Look at all that money. There's just flying off of these... What's the highest uh, fever count you've gotten, by the way? Oh, I've gotten in, like, the quadruple digits before. Hell yeah. Uh, do you want to go... Yeah, let's head up here. I don't... Wait, where are these items? Oh, okay, we're close. Yeah, we're close. Uh, uh, here. No, I think we need to go this way to loop around again. like I care. But I care. Yeah, gotta go up here. Yeah, here. yeah, whenever the spell activates, it, it just here. can't handle it. I love it. It's even better with the uh, with all the effects uh, turned on. Uh, is it over here, maybe? I love my uh, trail of EXP. <laughs> <laughs> oh wait, no, it's, it's over here. I also love how fast Moon Spell is. Just absolute powerhouse. This is the upgraded Minya Moon Spell, though. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Where the hell is this thing? I I can't see the screen. I told you we we did it wrong. Oh shit! Oh well, we can come. still get the pink no, one. No, give, come. We can still get the pink one on our way down here. Yeah, go over there wrong too. Come on. I mean, what's wrong with that? <laughs> Whatever. All I'll get is more powerful. Exactly. Oh yeah, it's down here. So what are you? Oops. No, you're, just, you're good. You're good. It might occasionally throw science at enemies. I love that. All right, let's go get some more. Science. Ooh, yeah, baby, science. And... Okay, we can go get everything else if we want to. Ah! It just can't do it. 
I love it. But hey, you're still moving at a decent pace, so it hasn't fully slowed down yet. We'll probably get there by minute 28, maybe? Does this Ma version ever slow down? I've managed to make it slow down once. And we're talking like... <laughs> okay, I'm good. <laughs> like, it, it threw up just a tiny bit in its mouth. And it's just, oh, what the hell is that? I, okay. have, I have made the switch chug to uh, three frames... Actually, probably one frame per second. Hell yeah. Well, you know, that's like two or three frames per second, essentially. It's... It was like 70 minutes, I, I had Queen Sigma and a whole bunch of crazy weapons, including... Oh, Queen Sigma, yeah. Oh, yeah. Hey, hey, uh, that's a, that's a nice everything you have there. What if I threw a black hole at it? Hey! Power up! So, periodically grants a random stat boost for the rest of the run. That's insane. A, oh, yeah, yeah, I get, get stuff. Boon. I get stuff, I get stuff. Torna's box. Or Tora's box. <laughs> Is there anything else? I keep seeing that there's a item around here. Oh, there's the arrow. Yeah, see, I can't see that. <laughs> I keep losing. The EXP is gonna hurt me! Ah! It's gonna hurt me! Don't hurt go. me! Don't let it, don't let it don't go! Hurt me. Me. Ah! Don't hurt me! Don't hurt me! You stuck behind a wall, mate. Bookcase. Oh, sorry, bookcase. You and your books ah, again. Oh no, don't let it get me! <laughs> <laughs> I'm running for EXP. It's like the uh Oh shit, what is the uh da dangerous shroom, dangerous one up? Yeah. What's that called again? Green Demon. Green challenge. Demon, yes. Oh, oh it's close. And it is somewhere around here. Have you done any of the adventures yet? No, I haven't yet. I've uh delved a little bit into the first one. I'm kind of trying to keep myself pure for the goddamn Switch version whenever those come out. Is it worth it, would you think? Do you want more vampire survivors? Oh, uh, every time. Do you like it when you're? Uh, <gasps> Yay! Do you like it when uh, your missions have context? Uh, yeah. Well, here they added some context to to some runs. That's so. awesome. Uh, report. It's, ba it's basically just hey, here here's more here's more vampire survivors, and then we had it's like some uh, like a, 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 a little bit of a sprinkling of a dusting of a story on top, and some added challenges with certain characters and items. Good luck. I'm down. Ooh, we need to get in there. How do we get in there? Oh, there is a door up here. How do we get in here, guys? Do you guys oh, know? Yeah. Oh, yeah, the door. How do we get in? Gotcha. And oh, then, it's like all... the upper left. Well, we better show up what happens when you fail. Yeah, yeah, we can show that. Oh, my God, again? Yes! Ultimate power! <laughs> 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 oh, yeah, here we go. Yeah, yeah. Uh, Everything froze, and ye it is not working anymore. So, I, so I, I find whenever time freezes, the glass fandango just goes absolutely wild. Yeah, it's trying to it's trying to render not only your stuff, but also just all the freezing and everything. It, it's trying so hard. I, Spellstorm plus glass fandango is having a hell of a time. I do believe I have randomized everything now, so I am at full power. Awesome. Probably the fullest power I'll get unless if I somehow get. Yeah, the unless you get a uh, another another dude. You yeah, could uh, get. I'll uh, pick this up. All right. I'll kill this guy. Okay. There and you go. he's gone already. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Uh, let's uh, let's let's go ahead and loop down if we can. All right. Yeah, I'm not even taking damage anymore. I'm I've got so much going on that damage is meaningless. See when I see I always say when you're doing red or yellow numbers, you're doing you're doing fine. Yeah, I think at this now point we've got nothing but red and yellow. Exactly, yeah. Ooh. Oh, yeah, I see it, I see it. I thought that's what it's ah! uh, Alright. <laughs> get reach into the wall and get Just it! smash through the window and get over there and get it! All right, we're just about... Oh, you've got an upgrade. I got the buy bracelet. Yep. And now you do two hits, I think. Yeah, so this is what happens when you fail. It just throws a lot more people at you. Oh, no. Maybe it's something that hurts you or something. Yep. Maybe. All right, let's, uh, let's head down this way. Oh. Yeah, I'm just gonna press A as soon as the upgrade screen comes up. That's because, what I'm doing. Yeah, just let it happen. Let it happen, just man. Just let, let it happen. Let it happen, man. Let it happen. Let it happen, man. Let's see. Got. 
Yeah, I'm, I'm lost right now. Oh, here we go. Uh, gimme. Might mini occasionally imposter. stab enemies. Little, little mini imposter. Just push button. Away we go. I think the part that got me so addicted to this game is finding a freaking good build. Just going, okay, the the start of my mission, I need to get this, this, and this, fully upgrade that, and then get this, this, and this, fully upgrade that, and then, oh my god, pure power. I think my fondest, well, I, I guess my first memory of Vampire Survivors is when I realized that, oh, because, you know, hey, five bucks, this, this is a game that everyone just will not shut the fuck up about. And whenever people talk at length about a game, I tend to listen. Still, jury's still out on, uh, Lethal Company, but I'm, I assume we'll get there one day. Yeah. Where's the red guy? Oh, there he is. So, uh, I go ahead and pop in Vampire Survivors, you know, five bucks, check it out, why not? I, I show up on a field. Yep. Throwing some magic balls. I was a Melvin at first. Hmm, okay. It's okay. And we're just doing this, just and doing we're killing this, bats. Doing bat here, get the thing. Kill a bat, get the thing. Ah, oh, okay. Then about like two minutes in, a gigantic swarm of bats just launches from off screen like, Whoa, God! Okay. Hmm. That's new. And then I started getting more powerful, and I kept sticking with it, and I realized that, oh wait, I'm not really supposed to die at all. Oh, that's the, the point is to not die. They're gonna be like, oh, up oh, you lost. That means you didn't power up enough. Did, 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 did. Yeah, you, you, you didn't power up enough. You need more coins to get more attack power and to get more defense and to have yeah, the enemies and, to, you know, do deal less damage and uh, all that. That's been one of my favorite parts. Is you start out and you think, oh man, I really suck at this game. No, that's by design. Yeah, you do. So uh, buy stuff and yeah, get better. Get better. Get better, idiot. Oh, the, of course they don't sing. Yay! Might occasionally take a hit for you. That's pretty neat. Hell yeah, let's go, brother! Yeah! Yeah, man, this is so sweet. <laughs> Dude, where'd you get it from? Oh, an imposter. Dude, oh. that is so sweet. <laughs> <laughs> just imagine just going, Who should we vote? And then you just visualize an imposter taking off another guy's head, and you just go, is that real? Then you go, wish a, a swirl of colors, <laughs> and just an absolute dimension of flashing lights and <laughs> different shapes and designs, and oh you can't see or God, hear anything. Oh my God, where when, am I? And when you finally come down, you're out in space. Oh. I wasn't the imposter! I got ejected for no reason, Did damn he just, it! He just self-voted himself for some reason. <laughs> he just voted for himself! The try bracelet as in, TRY AND TAKE ME DOWN, MOTHERFUCKERS! Bracelet. So, there, I, uh, there's a few content creators I watch, and every now and again they play Among Us. And, uh, one of the ah. coolest mods that they've... In I mean, this is not from Inner Sloth at all, it's from, you know, third parties and fans, is, uh, basically putting in Town of Salem roles. What? Uh, so Town of Salem is like, uh, werewolf or mop, uh, hidden mafia or whatever it's called. Uh, okay. Basically creating roles and giving them to the different characters. And I just think that's amazing because you've added so much extra playability. Like, there's extra enemy roles, there's extra neutral roles, friend roles. It adds infinite playability to Among Us, a game that already had pretty much a good formula for infinite playability. And uh, that mod showed up around the time where, uh, even though this was the most played thing ever, it was getting kind of stale. What? It's me! I know it is you. Why can't I... Pick anything though. Uh, reroll. Let's try that. There we go. What if I want one of those? Oh, Man. Nice. Hope it shows up again. Hope so too. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Now my, now my, the, the, the knives and the bones bounce now. That's hilarious. Especially since you're throwing infinite knives just all over the place. I mean, look, the knives are just bouncing everywhere. I know. <laughs> <laughs> stop, 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 stop. You're gonna hurt me now. What else? 
What do we got? Ooh, I know there's there's a chest down here. Where? There it is. Yeah, the, in in all the madness. Oh my god, it's like way down here. How did we miss this? Oh, it's in the lava. Oh. God, you're moving so fast. Oh wait, I I might be able to get an upgrade off of this chest. Find it. Oh, there it is. I can't even see me. Yeah! Button! The eject button! Ooh. Occasionally destroys all type of one enemy. Hilarious! They just vanish. Because they were the imposter. Exactly! Vote them out! Oh. What's over there? Oh. Another upgrade ah. for your bracelet. Ah. Hey, ah. look! Ah. There we go. Ah. So now we're all fully upgraded. For real. Uh, well, for realsies this time. Uh, yeah, goodbye. <laughs> So, I guess, technically, for the next 7 minutes and 20 seconds, we don't really have to do anything. Because multiple enemies will just be ejected out of nowhere. That's a tad overpowered among us, but amazing. Best feeling is when you can stop playing with two hands. Well, I mean, technically, this is already a one-handed game, isn't it? Besides having to press A occasionally. Well, I, that, that's what I mean. I mean oh, okay, okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. We're, we're so leveled up all the way. We just, even, oh, hey. Even when we get chests anymore, there's, it's just, oh, you got money! Thank so you. So it's just, just go around and let all the numbers just explode off the screen. It's gonna be impossible to see this on YouTube. I can't wait to see how this gets rendered. That would be amazing. Put it at 2K, just, just to show YouTube what for. I'm gonna put it at 32K! I mean, just imagine if I still had, like, the flashing or everything. It's like, yeah, good luck. Welcome to part one of my 300 Vampire Survivor series all 8K videos. J Jesus. It is episode three, and I am on uh, terabyte number five. Ter yeah, terabyte number five. Hell yeah. So I, I'm a I'm the type of guy that saves everything when it comes to our projects. I'm the guy who has all the storage. I back up everything just to make sure if I ever ever need to go back or if my channel gets nuked by YouTube because you know uh, Capcom didn't like my Resident Evil playthroughs or something like that. They go crazy and they. I'm just sure go. they think they're wonderful. I'm glad they finally left the comment. But uh, yeah, that's why I save everything, and. Uh, there is a video on the Slow Mo Guys second channel talking about, oh yeah, I got a backup database of, uh, I think it's a hundred terabytes. Wow. And uh, by the end of the video, uh, Gavin just goes, oh yeah, so it's almost full. Like, Jesus Christ! Dealing with all that footage, my God. What is the biggest project either you or I have worked on, if you know off the top of your head? Uh, I've got it, I've got it beat. I am right now the the top dog when it comes to it. Uh, Danganronpa V3 was over two and a half terabytes. Oh, there's this thing. Hello, perish. I'm just gonna stay in this one spot wherever it is. Oh, I'm dying. All right, so I, I'm not invincible like you are. And That's just right there at his uh, chin. D die? You are chiseling away at his chin. Holy cow! And got him. All right. Oh, yeah. So eventually. At about the 25 minute mark, your screen just becomes a mess of enemies trying to get to you. There are actually so many enemies, they are pushing each other out of the way, trying to kill you. And that's just so much fun. It's pure catharsis for $5. And that's just for the base game. How many hours would you say you get out of the base game? Oh, I, I think before all the DLC dropped, I think I clocked in about like 50 hours or something. Yeah, seriously. I mean, I'm, I'm about at, like, 74 by now, and that's being generous. Yep. That's not even counting the Switch version, which I've clocked even more hours on that one, I'm sure. Before the Emergency Meeting DLC, I bought Vampire Survivor in the first two DLC packs. After tax, it was, like, $7. And I got hours and months of playtime out of it. Absolutely ridiculous. So, please, if you are physically able to handle all of this mess on screen... Get Vampire Survivor. This is why people have been talking about it. 
seeing number go up is just like, oh yeah, brain enjoys, brain likes. And all the DLC is like $2 a piece. Not even that. Yeah, so for the price of an indie game, you can get everything for this indie game. See, we talk about a show, we talk about bargain, even though this doesn't exactly fall in the requirements of under $5 with all the DLC and all the taxes added and all that. Eh, first of all, we don't count tax as uh, the final price of the game, of course. No, 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 no. No tax. But no this tax. game is probably one of the biggest bargains you could ever hope for. If you're talking about bang for your buck, this has like, you know, a, a nuclear megaton explosion <laughs> for every dollar you spend on this. Oh, hey, cool. Yeah, look at all that money. Yeah, I wanted to bring it to the channel at least once. I did a couple live streams and, you know, good luck Twitch trying to keep up with that <laughs> nonsense. Even when I re-uploaded it at a higher resolution, YouTube and the Twitch recording were just like, KILL ME! I'm already wondering how this is gonna go. I am very curious. I can't wait for this one to air. Let's see if I can try and render at a higher bit rate. That, that might help. I don't know. That'll definitely help. Because right now it's being recorded at a very high bit rate. There might be a little blurring from what I can see over my computer screen, but that's okay. That's... That's the recording software compensating. So it hasn't ruined anything. It hasn't slowed down at all. I can't wait to see how this how this finale goes. All right, we've got two minutes. Any closing words? Well, uh, all I can say is that it's, this is a magnificent game. Anyone anyone can get some enjoyment out of it because it it's uh, its enjoyment is so basic. It's so primal. It's something instinctual. Even it's, I mean. Being in control of a massive wave of death and a whole sea of numbers based on what you do, how can anyone not find some enjoyment in that? And the fact that you started from basically nothing. I think that's my favorite part, especially for this episode. What you're seeing on screen right now is the result of multiple hours of playing, getting better, evolving items, figuring out what goes with what, playing through the levels, figuring out how this game ticks. And then you get situations where you're just like right here and like, yeah, this is what it's all about. It's the fact that you came here. I started this game uh, in just a field with some bats. Now here I am on another planet, <laughs> wiping everything away. Exactly. Oh my god, I love it. Level 238. What's your highest level? Oh, I don't know that. It's... yeah. It, it, whatever it is can be easily beaten by going on endless mode. Correct. Yes. Just, you know, going to bed. <laughs> <laughs> you wake up and your switch is slag. <laughs> oh! oh, oh, oh uh, it's so melty! Ew! And... I think my favorite part is when you can tell your console just does a deep exhale when death comes in. So, Xbox, you are almost free. You are almost free from this hell of Vampire Survivor. It's okay, mate. I see, I see smoke coming out the top. Oh, that's what the extra fan's for. Take Four, a look at Jet Engine! Three, two, one. <sighs> Everything on screen dies, and then Death comes in and says hi and kills you. I had my Tiragasus, which is why it's taking forever to kill me. Please kill me. I, and I was not meant to. There we go, there we go. Yeah, so that also happens Ooh. in co-op mode, where if one of your friends dies, after a certain amount of time, they come back. I got a new achievement, are you kidding me? There you go. Oh, wait, I don't have achievements anymore. I got them all. That's Vampire Survivor. Thanks for watching. Uh, next time, it's me again. So I get to choose another game we get to play. Ooh, for a bargain. Now, can this one actually be under $5 so we don't have to do any... I mean, don't want to have these premium bargains all the time. Absolutely, I got you. All right. I got you. See you next week.